Ladies and gentlemen, this professional lightweight battle is set for three five-minute rounds, and it is brought to you by the Zero Hour Podcast. Introducing first, he's fighting out of the blue corner. He steps into the cage tonight with a record of zero wins and two losses. His height, five feet, ten inches, and his weight, 155 and one half pounds. He trains independently and he fights out of Ottawa, Tennessee. His name is Thomas Grady. And his opponent across the cage and fighting out of the red corner. He steps into the cage tonight with a record of zero wins and four losses. His height, six feet, and his weight, 156 pounds. He trains with shield systems, and he fights out of Knoxville, Tennessee. Ladies and gentlemen, his name is Chialico Mike Douglas. Mike Douglas. Thomas Grady, here we go. Big Luke Wilson in the cage. It's always awesome talking to these guys before the fight and then seeing the intensity that they bring inside the ring. It's usually a different person. Absolutely. Yeah, Mike Douglas was a three-time amateur MMA champion. Oh, oh man, nice. great timing. And that's cage control by Douglas. It's got to be a tough spot for Grady. Mike Doug Douglas is a big 155er. He is a big guy. He is. I agree. Mike Douglas slowly, slowly getting on to. Thomas Grady looking for oh, that exact take down. there. Grady, sorry, Douglas, very tight on top of Grady, not giving him an inch. He's been relentless in the grappling transitions here. Really nice pressure by Douglas. Ground and pound. And as we go into the pro fights, we're going to see a little more of this. We'll see these guys be more technical, take less risk. Yep. You know, because that loss on your record, once you're a pro, it sticks with you forever. Both these guys really want to win. Absolutely right. Yeah, looking to put a w, uh, a w on the column here. It doesn't mean it's any, you know, it won't be any more exciting than the amateur bouts. But you'll see these guys kind of be more technical. A little bit more strategic. Yes. Yep. Short elbows there. These again, three Ooh, big five minute rounds. We are two minutes in to the first of three. Five minutes is in the turn. Brady setting up a triangle here. Oh. Let it go. I saw a setup. Running them bombs. Yeah. So I control by Douglas. Neon belly. Transitioning to full mount. The Jellico, Mike Douglas, definitely being the aggressor here in the first. Oh, man. That's going to cause some damage. What I'm seeing out of Mike Douglas is just control. Yeah. He's controlling Absolutely. this fight. Yeah, he's controlling his back arm. Can you see this rear tie-up? Yes. Torres Finney takes advantage of that a lot of times. And that's going to put your opponent in a position where they have one less defensive uh, system here. Grady able to come free of that, but put himself in a bad position while doing so. Oh, that elbow oh, hit. Elbows. Man, that's elbows. Bad. That's bad. Big Luke Wilson. Watching the action here, waiting for Grady to be making a better move. Good control again by Douglas. 
He's maintained this position, throwing great elbows, great ground and pound. Luke Wilson's watching this close. Yeah, tough spot for Grady to be in. There's not much to say. I mean, Douglas is just so heavy on him that, oh, man, those elbows are going to rack up. We're just seeing a different technical ability. You know, uh, Grady, very tough guy, good opponent, but Douglas just having maybe a little bit more technical advantage. Grady's hanging in in there. Yeah, Grady is hanging in. He's, he's got to make a plan for, for an escape here. Oh, oh what? Man, those, those elbows, elbows are so nasty. <laughs> Got 50 seconds left. A good ground and pound by Douglas. Oh, man, he's setting up a triangle. That is good, too. If he doesn't finish that triangle, this is just a good. Oh, wow, good Whoa. on Grady. What some flexibility. Wow. wow. Is Grady attacking the leg he's there? Straight the leg. arm bar. Oh, Douglas does not look concerned about it at all. Douglas is a brown belt, so he's staying very composed. Yeah. Mike Douglas is fighting for this victory. I think a, But uh, Grady's not going to give it to him. No, I think that, that would have been smart for Grady. He saw an attempt there for a knee bar, but did not commit to it in the time he needed to. Great first, first round. round. Yeah. Grady, great first Grady round. kept working, kept trying to slice that leg to get into a, a full, you know, into the guard or get into a half guard. He looked good. Both, you know, in defensive positions. Yeah, that round was all Mike Douglas. Right. However, Grady had his moments of defense. Grady you know. did well, yeah. He did very well. That was put himself into a couple, couple really tough spots. Good first round. But that being said, Mike Douglas had a dominant round, uh, controlled the entire first round. Great ground to pound, great elbows. Samantha, after a hard round like that, what do you anticipate out of Mike Grady's corner? And what's he going to look like coming out? Um, I'm thinking that he's going to try to stay on his feet as much as possible. Oh, my gosh, what a kick from right. Douglas. Wow. Lost all train of thought there. Yeah, Sorry, that Kyle. That was a textbook. <laughs> oh, oh, man, what a wow. take down from down. Grady. Great entry there. It's like Grady. Sorry, for Douglas, rather. I'm sorry. We're getting, what, Ooh, getting elbows our names confused Grady. here. But, man. Douglas is looking great coming to the second round. Is that mission control? It looks like he's trying to throw up a triangle. We're seeing some Diaz jiu-jitsu by Grady. Yeah, we're kind of in a tough angle where we're at, but. Yeah, he's think, locked oh, it. He's Grady, got the triangle. Yeah, Grady has it now. He's just got to change his angle a little bit. It's, it's not locked. where he wants to be. Has. Okay, a sucks. lot of space there. It's not tight, but Douglas don't get See, out. Grady there. needs to grab that leg. Grady needs to grab that the right leg oh, of Douglas. Going. Come on! Wow! Arm bar, he's he's arm, arm bar here. Has he got it? Went from the knee bar oh. to an arm bar potentially. Oh man, that is pretty tight. That's oh, tight. That's tight. That's tight. It's tight. Douglas is looking what he can do. Both guys want this win. Douglas not seem too concerned Arms about out. his attack out. here. He's out. Yep, he Side is control, out. nail belly, mount. Ground and pound for Douglas. Oh, man, back to Nasty these elbows. Nasty elbows. Big Luke Wilson's not going to stand for this too much longer. Great attempt from Grady there. Yeah, great attempt, great jiu-jitsu. That uh, was great jiu-jitsu. Thomas Grady is a is a game opponent, uh, but Mike Douglas has just been a force 
a force with the top position, a force with ground and pound. Like his game plan is these elbows mm -hmm. that just never stop. Taking him to the cage. Elbows. Oh, man. Oh, Those are so bad. nasty. Oh, a guard's out. What a good reversal. Grady's been really surprising me here in the second. Grady Very is. Very tenacious guy. He's trying to pull this out of the fire, right? And uh, it looks like he has the tools on the ground with his oh. jiu-jitsu to do so. Uh, if he can withstand this onslaught by Mike Douglas in these uh, top dominant positions mm -hmm. in the grappling. But at this present time, uh, he's in Mike Douglas's guard. Oh. oh. Douglas. Uh, Douglas the, the, the triangle. The triangle. Elbows. Ooh, elbows. Some elbows before transitioning fully. See, we see this better bite and angle as he grabs the yeah. leg from Grady. Oh, Grady turned in some favors here. Wow, that's tight. That, wow. Is, that is it. Oh, wow. I'm so happy for Douglas. He needed it. Wow, wow, wow. That was some great defensive strategy from Grady in an attempt, but taking home the W. Great win for Mr. Jellico, Mike Douglas, as he improves that record to one and four. He will be joined by Kyle Mays for post-fight interview here. Lots of good respect and camaraderie between these two athletes. Want to give a big shout out birthday to a good friend, Daniel Palmer. Happy 60th birthday, Daniel Palmer. Ladies and gentlemen, your referee pick, Luke Wilson, has brought a stop to this fight. Three minutes and four seconds into round number two. Your winner, by way of submission due to triangle.